Hey, this is Aptic. Yo, what's going on? My name is Fun Case from Circus Records, and you are listening to DJSounds.com at Rampage. Blah! We're actually premiering a, a, a collaboration we did together. Um, it's called Oh Shit, <laughs> and um, yeah, we we I mean we've been speaking for a long time, and it's been uh, a collaboration that's been in the making for a while. I think to be honest, so I'm just glad that we finally got to link up and do something good with it. I'm just really glad you made it with your plane because you were stressing me out. <laughs> you were stressing that. me out real bad. Yeah, I'll do that. I've been in drum and bass since back in whew, 2004, I think. And I was making it back then, I was DJing it back then, but not as serious. And for some reason, DJing uh, drum and bass was like the, the closest thing to what I liked at the time, which was death metal. <laughs> so it was like, it was almost like a natural progression. It's quite strange. The energy drum and bass gives, like the vibe you get, you can have the, the most somber track in the world, or you can have the most crazy track in the world. It's like every vibe you can get, you get in drum and bass. So it's, it, for me, it's probably the best genre in the world. When I started out mixing drum and bass, like it made every genre pretty easy. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, like like we're mostly mixing dubstep now, and it's yeah, it's 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 just a piece of cake in uh, comparison to drum and bass. Yeah. Drum and bass is like. It's probably the hardest thing to make as a genre. It's the most rewarding thing if you can nail it. It's definitely the hardest genre to make. So anything after drum and bass is the easiest thing you'll ever do. <laughs> like East German polka or something like that. I've, no, I've made loads of that. I made two albums, so yeah. Rampages, uh, young sweaty kids, uh, angry music. Um, late hours and people having sex in the crowd. <laughs> yes.